Welcome everybody back to another Boldcast Reaction. I'm Carson. I'm Lindsay. And this is, it's way more echoey without that blanket up. It's like a lot more echoey. This is Naruto Shippuden, episode 494. What happened last time? Last time we saw the Shikamaru story, wrap that all up. And uh, now going on to something else. Indeed. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoy. Hope you leave a like and subscribe. Hope you check out Patreon and support the official release. Let's go. Uh, once again, before we get into it, I haven't seen this. Um, I've seen parts of Borto, but this last bit I did not watch, just as a reminder. So I'm not like hogging the airtime uh, instead of letting Lindsay talk. I'm also reacting to this, just so you know. I'm like sitting right here, just so you know. Um, yeah, so let's go. Just I don't think I'll do a good job. You are a member of Team Seven. You've got to do it. Naruto, Shinata, congratulations. Don't be so stiff. <laughs> Deepest congratulations, Naruto and Hinata. Uh, can you act a little more natural? Like I told you before, I don't think I'll do a good job. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what that says. You must consider whether your hot blooded wish will translate through the lens. One hundred percent to Naruto and Hinata. What it really needs is something symbolic displayed on the screen. Wait, the sunrise! The sun surging over the horizon to mark the start of their life together. Give your message with that in the background, and you'll increase the impact of your that that one OP where they're like crying and <laughs> the Bach, cameras like, or is the ED botch going? Yeah. Oh no, that OP. Yeah. Of course they're well. Hey, and that's the wise crap. Naruto, Hinata, how about you? None of these people know how to use a camera. They're all like way too close. <laughs> Try again later on. Oh, I thought really it was gonna sensei. cut to Lee again <laughs> with the sunset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so as far as I know, this is um this is gonna be like slice of life stuff for the mm. last little bit, which I'm really it's just excited. Just sort of like for. wrapping up the like everything that's going on. Yeah. I'm excited. Seems cute so far. I wonder what his boot says, this cast. Mm -hmm. It's probably like springtime of youth or some <laughs> shit. <laughs> Who? Tukune, Sancho, Mibuna. How'd you even know that we were here? I'm a ninja. Knock off Konohamaru and friends. Yeah. What have you done? <laughs> I see. So this graffiti wasn't your guys doing, huh? It's quite aesthetically pleasing, so I figured that you guys must be the ones behind it. You know, you got pretty good eyes. <laughs> Ah, really oh, kids are so stupid. <laughs> Amazing, Erica. Compared to the antics I had to put up with from Naruto, <laughs> this stuff is practically adorable. Wait, Naruto? <laughs> you mean Naruto Uzumaki? <laughs> That's right, he went here. Were you of course he here? went, everyone <laughs> went here. Where else did he go? The third yeah, Hokage went here. You mean Naruto Uzumaki? The super famous Naruto Uzumaki? He's on a totally different level. There's no way that a plain and boring teacher like you taught him. <laughs> You're right, he actually didn't really learn anything from me. Yeah. However, I still take full credit. He was technically he was my, my student. student. Naruto is like, well, like a superhero to them. Oh, there you are. I guess he is so, like, out of control powerful, but at the same time, it's like, where do they think that he learned how to do it? He's a legend, man. I guess he's just, he's just too high above it. You're very popular among your this room. Well. They brought back this room. Perfect person for the job. Well, I. Oh, I see. 
If everyone goes to the ceremony, then we won't be able to assign any mission that day. <laughs> everyone in the village wants to go? Exactly. Send Choza. Choza can take care of it. You wanted Naruto to die anyway. <laughs> oh shit, Sakura. Naruto, it's been a while. I am oh. to be married. <laughs> That's a terrible rule. Fuck! That's just me. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's just because she was in debt and she wanted expensive shit. <laughs> She just randomly made that rule. A price tag on friendship. Yeah. yeah. If I do that, I'll be called the worst Hokage in history. And Naruto was poor as shit growing up, like. Responsibility that's right in front of you. Naruto would not want that. Why don't why why can't they just say like say what? make it so that like his closest friends can go or like they can have two shifts like it, however like be, the most important people can be at the ceremony and then like like then they can swap out for, like like later on and people can still come come say hi and congratulate them. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I know it's the plot of this, but I'm like, come <laughs> I on. I think they're going to figure it out. There's no way that they do that, because that's really stupid. The advancement exam? It was recommended I take it to become vice principal. What? what? Do, do vice principal? Mm. Does that mean I'm not among those being considered as a candidate? No, that can't be right. You're a specialized tutor. Do you really want to be the fucking principal? Naruto's upcoming wedding will be even more joyful now that it's- Are you guys catering? <laughs> That'd be sick. They better be. I will have to call you vice principal, Iruka-sensei. That would be so good. The wedding is just- Is wrong. It's wrong. just like, would you like- <laughs> Instead of like, would you like steak or fish or whatever, it's like, would you like pork or uh, shrimp? <laughs> I know that I'm supposed to be striving to get ahead in my career, but there's also a part of me that really wants to just continue teaching kids. One on one. Yeah. Well, yeah, of course. That's because you undoubtedly shine in the classroom. <laughs> Trying to sabotage. I think you seem a little too happy. <laughs> What's going on? Uh huh? Gosh, he says. Huh? Oh, Lord. Doesn't his jacket look so cool? Did you just drop the Lord part? He's, he's already finished eating, too. So. <laughs> well, all of you were going on about you, so. I love this so much. I can't even tell you how much I love this. <laughs> Vice principal? Oh, right. That position is open. Honestly, Who was it before? <laughs> I'm not entirely sure if I should take it. You? Taking the advancement exam? Now that would be quite difficult. Uh, huh? Well, I better get back to work now. <laughs> what does that mean? Thanks for coming. Does that mean it'd be difficult for him, or...? Ayame, did you take Lord Kakashi's order? Huh? When did he...? What was that all about? <laughs> What? <laughs> is, he, is he trying to like psych him out so that he d so he that does, he does take it? it? I don't know. It's clear to me that as the Hokage, Lord Kakashi doesn't believe that Iruka is suitable to be the vice I think you're right. Yeah. Oh, really? You taking the advancement exam? Even if you do take it with your skills. Imagine if that had been his voice. <laughs> you're like Ebisu's voice by Itachi as well. Mm, I mean, I'm not saying that. You probably told me that before. Lord Hokage must have meant. It's like saying that he already knows the outcome before Iruka Sensei even takes the exam. I mean, he does have the show. Oh, wait. <laughs> wow. What are you talking about? A second ago, you were. I'm taking it. Huh? <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna take that exam, and I'm gonna pass it. Naruto's about to have one of the biggest days in his whole life, and my gift to him will be my good news. Oh, right, Iruka. <laughs> well said. <laughs> Abisu, do you really want that position? Like, do you really well, want that Kona position? Well, is too old. Like, That's who true. else's teacher is he gonna be? His, his job is gone. We got you! <laughs> Classic. <gasps> A prank like that one is old news. <laughs> <laughs> but Naruto Uzumaki... <laughs> Throwing some spice into it. So maybe there's a future Naruto Uzumaki <laughs> among all of you. <laughs> it just now becomes like... Enough. A contest of who can be the most bad because <laughs> they heard sure. Naruto was. Cheat on a test, you know? <laughs> oh my god, Lee dumbbells! Just that like 
Fucking 100 pound dumbbells? No way. No way, that's too far. When did that get there? you guys were gonna try something like this. The pranks you pull are on such a small scale. Why to Naruto? Scroll and graffiti on the Hokage's great stone faces is nothing. He even took the scroll of sealing and wreaked a whole lot of havoc in the village. So you're pretty badass when you put it like that. Shut up! Who cares about him? Mm. I'm not him! They feel kind of bad for those kids just getting like compared. Yeah, yeah. They can't even they can't even get attention by like being bad because they're not bad enough. Yeah. Everyone says great things about him, and he was Naruto's teacher. He's a shoeish. Ebisu sitting there like I taught him way more than Aruka ever did. What did he teach him? He taught him how to walk on water. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, he did that take. Was, yeah, he literally thing. did. Wow. True. Cool thing. I can pull off anything that Naruto Uzumaki did, and just as easily too. Let's go. Show me out. <laughs> it's okay. Naruto didn't have friends either. Oh, welcome, Lord Hokage. Really? Could you please drop the Lord stuff? Huh? Iruka's actually planning on taking the exam, and it's all thanks to you, Kakashi. It's thanks to me. What did I do? I love how he actually calls him Kakashi. <laughs> oh, that smells delicious. <laughs> or was you were just lurking Seems around the village? Wait, Wait, what did he say? Seems they didn't order pot stickers though. Oh. <laughs> Wait, are you Does Orochimaru love dumplings? I really didn't mean it that way at all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. He says. It's just that regarding the advancement exam, how many times do I need to ask you to drop? Or is the exam going to be on the wedding day or something? The scroll of sealing oh has been my stolen. God. Maybe if you haven't given them any good ideas. That was, that was fully on you, by the way. <laughs> you literally told him to do that. I knew that I'd find you here. You're planning to use a shadow clone from the scroll of sealing and pull off a flashy prank, aren't you? Well, let me guess what you're planning. To say you know what I'm thinking? No, I actually don't know what you're thinking. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I keep comparing students to the ones I had in the past. <laughs> but doing that is preventing me from seeing into the heart of the precious student right in front of me. Iruka <laughs> sensei all you want is to be acknowledged, don't you? And I didn't see you kept bragging about an old student. <laughs> How long have I been a teacher anyway? I have been such a fool. I'm so sorry, Tsukune. Mm. So did you mean it? Mm. You know, about... I think anyone here can become a hero just like Naruto. You simply have to believe in yourself and always try to do your best. Of course, I did mean it. Okay, then. I guess that I could give that whole trying my best idea a shot. <laughs> yeah. I'm very sorry about what my student did, and I take full responsibility for it. I bet, I bet it's a fake. Do me a favor and confirm what's inside of there, will you? Huh? Gosh, she set this whole shit up. To me, love is life. Love is absolutely everything you see. There's no <laughs> way that I'd leave the real thing where it can be stolen so easily. Not again. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is why Kakashi is Hokage. Shit like this. Oh yeah, let's see. Vice principles more than I can handle. Huh? Oh, a principal. Oh, no, when I said difficult, the advancement exam is going to be on the same day yeah, as Naruto's a... wedding. <laughs> There's no way that you can miss his wedding. Anyway, I could schedule an extra day for the advancement exam. Yeah. I'd really like you to These part the one, principal. they know what they're doing with the part one soundtrack. Example to all the other I'm sorry. I've decided not to take the exam. Forgot about all of my students who are right in front of my eyes. I have failed them all as a teacher. Picking favorites. I mm -hmm. to go celebrate. I've got to take care of my current students and cherish all of the things that are right in front of me. I think I understand. Cherish the things that are right in front of you. Oh. It's more important to fulfill the responsibility that's right in front of you. Huh. Yes, you're right. <laughs> well, I've decided 
decided to. Uh -huh. About what? I assembled all of you here today in order to relay something to you as your sixth Hokage. Day off. I'm giving you a secret mission. Each of you is to prepare a congratulatory gift for Naruto and Hinata's wedding. Report back <laughs> one week before the ceremony and make sure to have your gift at the ready when you do. Really? Boost the belief economy <laughs> like crazy. <laughs> I can't wait to see the leaves. <laughs> That's version. about it. Turns around. What? You can't wait to what? Oh, I just I can't wait to see what it, what Lee brings. <laughs> I bet it's gonna be either a leotard, some leg warmers, or some leg weights for training. I hope we get to see all everyone's gifts or like. We're really doing this. But it's not price. It's the quality of the gift. Prepared to be called the worst Hokage in the history of the leaf for this. The worst Hokage in the history of the leaf? That's a. It's all thanks to you, Irokage. <laughs> what is that face? Did you see that? Did you see his face? Yeah. Like that. I know. Oh, this is awesome. This is awesome, but I'm st I'm still annoyed. We, you you guys are highly skilled. Like. What were you gonna say? I was just saying, you you guys are highly skilled ninjas who excel in battle plans and strategy and you can't figure out that the easy solution to this is just have whoever is Naruto's closest to at the wedding and have all the literal random people that he's not friends with not be he's at the wedding. He's friends with everyone. I guess, but- He's friends with everyone okay, at this point. But the, but it's been two years. He, but everyone at the loves same Naruto. time, there are like there are people who are clearly closer to him. Well, than, yeah, than but, other people. Well, sure, but it's been it's been two years. You don't even know what he's been through the last two years, going on missions, meeting new people. We only saw him for what? How many? Three, four years? It's been two years of shit that we haven't seen, and like relationships that he's probably formed. Do you think he's just been hanging around with the same people after he became the hero of the fucking world? He's been going around. Everyone loves Naruto now. I He's, know. he's known the world over. I think everyone should have an equal chance. I'm sure his best friends are gonna make it in, but there's hundreds of people now, thousands of people who wanna go to this wedding, possibly from different villages too. So everyone should get a chance. Honestly, everyone should just take a day off. It should be Naruto day, as far well, as I'm concerned. I guess concerned. they need to be prepared in case, like, for, and for other stuff. Some people can be, uh, some people can be like on guard or something, you know? You can make it work. You can make it work. I don't know, everyone have a day off, but you know, a certain amount of people are security detail, but they still get to be there. I mean, what's gonna happen? Uh, what's the worst that could happen? It looks like Orochimaru <laughs> might be at the wedding, so who knows what could happen. That was awesome. I love Orochimaru <laughs> going around like town. lurking around. I mean, it's funny because it just, it, it's, I like that because it's it shows how absurd it is that he's just around now. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, it's but making <laughs> fun of the fact that he just like got out of that with no repercussions. I mean, he's just like <sighs> he's just hanging around. Well, here's uh, somebody in the comments actually put it in a really good way. In World War II, there were uh, there was Werner von Braun who was the founder of NASA. And uh, but he later became the founder of NASA. What he actually was was a Nazi scientist that that did crazy experiments and shit, was a full-fledged Nazi, was taken in, and all of his research was taken in by uh, the US, and he, I, I'm pretty sure at least he was, at least he was one of the founding members, or he founded NASA in the States. And it's, it, I think they're, they're literally drawing, maybe it's Japan, so maybe not on that specifically, but that kind of shit, where, in wartime and in the past, like and especially with Naruto's theme of making peace and everything, mm -hmm. and putting the past behind it and stopping that cycle of hatred, I think there's something to Orochimaru being, you know, dropped of all charges as long as he doesn't do some crazy shit anymore. And it seems like um, having seen the depths of, I think we talked about this before, but having seen the depths of chakra, the depths of jutsu, just getting to the root of everything and knowing the truth behind everything, which he probably does at this point, um, he kind of achieved his goal in a way. He doesn't actually, he isn't actually able to perform every kind of jutsu, but he knows every kind of jutsu at this point. He can kind of see and understand everything. He's gotten to the root of, of all shit. So, um, 
you know, there's nothing to be gained from like being evil and doing all these experiments unless he is just actually evil, but it never seemed like he actually was. It seemed like there's a lot more to his character than that. That being said, he was a real piece of shit. Anyway, I loved this episode. I, I this was so great. This was so awesome. Main was story. Whole thing only one episode, or have we? We just sat. This was one episode. Oh, it felt one. like an hour long. It was good though, right? Yeah, it was. An, it just felt like so much stuff was happening. Uh, really packed, really well paced episode. Lots of different mm -hmm. perspectives. I liked that the main story was Aruka, B story Kakashi, and both of them are learning their how to move on. Mm -hmm. It's similar to uh, to Shikamaru and uh, Sasuke's arc after after uh, the last and everything. After everything's over, how do we move on? What's the future going to look like for the village in this new era of peace? What's Kakashi as a Hokage going to be like? He's, he's, he clearly doesn't like being Hokage. Every time anybody acknowledges that he's the Hokage, he Mostly. tells no, them to I stop. No, I wouldn't go that far. Yeah, <laughs> he doesn't, uh, he takes the job seriously, but he's, uh, he's, the thing is, is he's a perfect Hokage. Actually, just his whole approach to it. He has that like wild energy that the third sometimes did of like that. Oh, I guess we'll see how it goes, eh? <laughs> like that type of shit. Uh, you know, and just the kind of chill attitude, seeing the forest for the trees type, uh, type attitude. Mm -hmm. He really gets it. He really gets it, but uh, he doesn't like it. <laughs> and that's clear. He is just warming the seat until Naruto gets there and doing his best and trying to understand what it, what it's about. I'm gonna laugh so much if Naruto just fucking hates being Hokage because <laughs> you don't actually do anything. You're just paperwork. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, we'll see. You like Konohamaru? His eyes are looking especially blue. I know, I was thinking that. I was like, he I don't remember different. him looking like that at all. Let's see here. Oh, oh, don't look. Yeah, don't look. Yeah, he had black eyes. Yeah, that. see, this is why he's looking different. Because yeah. that's Because he literally didn't look like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, he, he, they gave him blue eyes and he looks completely different. Yeah. I wish they kept his black eyes. I wonder why they gave him blue eyes. His mom must have blue eyes. The Saratobis have dark eyes maybe they and dark just, hair. Maybe they just did that with his new design. Maybe for Boruto, they wanted him. Wanted some color or wanted some like, I don't know, some, wanted some detail or something. Cause rather, cause if he's an adult guy, with you know, Maybe with it's just brown just hair and dark eyes. Adults with just plain black eyes, Kakashi. Black eyes Aruka, and brown hair. Yamato. But he, um, at, he kind of like imagine if he just had the black eyes as an adult, he'd probably look just like a normal dude, like one of the background yeah, guys. Yeah, they did that to try and make him look more of like a character. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't like know. it. I don't like it. It, it. it takes away a lot of his character. That and also they change the eye shape, mm -hmm. is another big thing. He, he had like this kind of scrunched up like, mm. and maybe it's a change in his character that he's kind of growing up and less of a little shit. But <laughs> I really preferred his, his a, lot of it, a lot of the detail of his like character is lost in, his, in the visual design when you when you change yeah. that much. Yeah, it's- He it's, does look look a lot like, he's he's getting the Minato like side things and the uh, the, the hair, mm. the spiky hair in the back very- Yeah, uh, I feel like the overall design is good for him, but I feel like the change of eye color like really throws me off more than I would have expected. Yeah. And I couldn't figure out what it was. I was like, he looks like, he looks di like really different. Mm -hmm. Like not, not just, you know, they, they aged him up. Like, he, yeah, they, they changed that. So anyway, I guess that's not super relevant, but it's pretty it's relevant. Something that we noticed. Um, yeah, uh, one second. I just want to check one thing. Iruka Sensei English voice change. They changed his voice actor. Mm. English voice actor for Ruka change. I just want to see. Yeah, did you can see it in our Wikipedia page. It looked up really quick. He was working on Kingdom Hearts at the time. That sucks. That sucks. Because I noticed that change and it's it's really difficult to get used to. Anyway, hope you guys leave a like and subscribe. See you in the next one. I'm Carson. I'm Lindsay. Bye-bye.